Hey guys, I just, I'm going to quickly show you how to fat, quickly pass the dip to car grill. You know, from this, high, a lot of chrome and stuff, to basically a darkened out look like this. Basically a, so it looks less flashy. And also protects it from bugs and stuff. What you really need is basically a, a brush, some masking tape, some painter's tape, and some, a can of pasta dip. This is very rough. So it's been a, another thousand miles, and a lot of driving along the farmlands and the coast, up and down California. So I noticed that the mosquitoes and bugs and everything has been eating away at um, my paint and stuff. So I have to wash it every week and wax it. So what I did was like, hey, why not just cover this with pasta dip to protect this part? Now this is just a one part uh, test experiment. I want to basically pasta dip this chrome trim because it really looks too bright and flashy to me. I don't really like a flashy car. So I'm gonna go ahead and plastic tip the, the two large chrome chrome areas and just cover it up a little bit and also the grill I have on the bottom just to hide everything. So what I did was I basically got some liquid detergent soap and washed off any oils, bugs, and everything or grit and off the off the chrome grill and also the grill below and dried it all off. And you definitely have to dry it off to uh, before you put plastic tip. I masked off a minimal mask around the plastic dip where it possibly would drip. I'm not too worried about plastic dip because you can always peel it back off. I tried the plastic dip on a painted surface as well as the plastic part offside, you know, just to make sure it didn't destroy the plastic. So I just quickly did a quick round, the first coat. Like I said, it was really fast. It's, you have to work really quickly with plastic dip because it, it hardened really quickly. So it was really quick. You just basically paint one coat, then paint another coat on top of it. Um, after about 10 to 15 minutes of um, It'll take about 10 to 15 minutes to dry the first coat and then just let it air out put another coat on and In about one or two coats. It's actually pretty much done uh, If you want to you put another coat if you want, but it really don't need to the detailed work of the emblems The emblems actually if you paint over it You could actually just take it off and rub it off So a lot of the detail of the emblems can be cleaned off by using a little blade or just using your fingernail and you know, rubbing off the extra uh, plastic dip that's on the side, and it's gonna fit perfectly nice. It's actually very easy to use plastic dip, and you know it's great to to use on this. I also tried doing it on my back uh, tailgate area so I could protect it, but it didn't turn out very well because I forgot to take off the wax. So, anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe, and you know, stay tuned for more. Thanks a lot. Bye. -bye. Mm -hmm.